In this video, I'm going to show you how to execute the match statement to retrieve nodes from a graph in Neo4j browser. Before you query the graph, it is a good idea to understand what is in the graph. If you click the database icon here, you can see some information about the graph. For example, here we see that the graph has 172 nodes and 253 relationships. This gives us a rough idea of how large the graph is. If we click a node label, for example, person, the graph engine performs a query against the graph using the match statement to retrieve up to 25 person nodes. The match statement uses n as a variable that references person nodes that are retrieved. The match statement returns n, which means that it will return the nodes retrieved from the graph. If we click the movie label, a similar type of query executes using the match statement, which returns up to 25 movie nodes in the graph. In the query editor pane, we call DB schema to view the data model of the graph. The data model shows all of the node labels defined in the graph and the relationships defined between the nodes in the graph. So, for example, we see that a person node has an acted in relationship to a movie node in our data model. This view only provides information about the data model and not about specific nodes. In the query editor pane, you can recall past queries, modify them, and rerun a match statement. Here we want to view all of the person nodes in the graph, not just 25 of them. When we run this match statement, the graph engine returns 133 nodes with the label person. Notice that the retrieval also indicates that these returned nodes include three relationships, which are connections between a set of nodes. This information about relationships between the person nodes is shown in Neo4j browser because we have selected that result nodes will be connected in the display. So, we can zoom out to try to find the person nodes that are connected by the follows relationship. And that's a quick look at how to retrieve nodes from a graph using the match statement.